It's time for long draw. I tend to do a supported long draw. That's my favorite style of long draw. And I don't do a long, a sweeping long draw very often because I have a crabby shoulder. And when I do long draw for too long, my shoulder starts talking to me and I have to stop. So if you have any shoulder problems, I don't suggest doing a sweeping long draw or much sweeping long draw. Long draw loves a airy preparation. I'm going to show you first on some commercial roving and then I will show you on some top spun from the fold and I'll show you top spun from the end and you can see how the twist grabs each one of these preparations differently. The setup for my wheel is with a little extra twist. I'm on my ladybug on the smaller whorl that comes standard with the ladybug on the regular uh, whorl. And I have my twist turned up a little because I my twist, my tension turned up a little because I want to get this yarn on to the bobbin as fast as I can. So it will be airy, airy, airy. When I start, I'll always keep my yarn hand in the front. And what I'm going to do is open and close it while I draw my fiber hand back. And I will show this to you also from a distance so you can see what it looks like from far away. So I'm opening, I'm gathering twist behind my thumb, opening it and letting it go into the fiber as I'm drawing my hand all the way back and then I let it wind on and then I do it again build up a little twist just opening and closing my fingers as I draw back that gives me some a little more to tension against and it helps me keep my long draw yarn a little more consistent But, you know, this wild flying free twist really grabs on to the disorganized fibers of this roving. But if you don't have roving, you can spin from the fold. Here's some top fluffed out, folded over my finger the twist catches on to that. I'm finding it to be a little harder to draft back because of the organization of the fibers. So I need a little stronger pull as I'm drafting back, but I absolutely can do it. Gathering twist, opening my fingers, gathering twist, opening my fingers as I smoothly draft backwards. You can also do it with top from the end. Gathering twist, drafting back. Gathering twist, drafting back. This one, again, I'm having to pull. It's a little more inconsistent. because the preparation isn't airy, there's not space for those fibers. There's not space for the air of the draft to get in and those fibers to grab onto each other. But you can absolutely do it. All right, let's see what it looks like from far away. <laughs> 